Welcome to my biology practicals. We are dealing with food tests. And I want us to test for ascorbic acid. Now, ascorbic acid is also called vitamin C. To test for vitamin C, the solution that we use is DCPIP, it's blue in color. We are going to have a solution, solution B, and we have another solution we are calling solution Y. So we want to know between solution B and solution Y, which has ascorbic acid. So the procedure, I'll take one test tube for the first experiment. I'll put the DCPIP first, that is the solution we used to test. And then I'm going to take my solution B and place into the test tube. And you can see the blue color is not changing. So this blue color is retained. Now I go to the next experiment for the next solution. I'll again first put into my test tube the DCPIP. And then now I'll take my solution Y and I'll put into my DCPIP. And I shake and you can see there is color change. The DCPIP decolorizes. So this was solution Y and this was the one for solution B. So this means that in the solution Y, it had ascorbic acid. So if the DCPIP decolorizes, we say there's presence of ascorbic acid. If the blue color of the DCPIP does not change or it is retained, if the blue color of the DCPIP is retained, we say ascorbic acid absent. So I hope it is now clear and easy for you to remember this easy procedure that we first put the DCPIP into the test tube and then we put the food substance and then you observe what happens. So thank you for watching.